Michelle Jones, and I am co-owner of Flathead Freaks Catfishing Adventures, wife of Matt Cat Matt Jones, and we're out here on Jordan Lake today in Alabama, and I want to talk to you today a little bit about backing up a trailer. I know a lot of us like to go fishing with our husbands and our spouses and significant others, and a lot of women feel intimidated by backing up the trailer and putting them in the water. So I want to give you a couple tips that'll make it a little bit easier. First of all, don't fret, don't panic. It's not that big a deal. Having a trailer is just an extension of yourself and it just swivels in the middle, that's all. What I suggest is practice. Go to a parking lot that's got the lines in it and just practice. Backing up, keeping right straight in the lines. Don't get in a rush. Don't be intimidated by the other boats and trailers that are around you. What you're going to do is you're going to pull up, get yourself straight. You're going to take, look behind you, make sure you're all clear. Get out and drop your tailgate. That'll give you a wider view if you turn around and look out your back window. It gives you more view of the boat and the trailer. So what you want to do is you're going to put it in reverse. You're going to start backing up. Just go slow. Go slow. And remember, whichever way you want that trailer to go, turn your steering wheel the opposite way. I mean, we're women. We do a lot of multiple tasking things. We have children, we have jobs, we have homes, we have spouses. You can handle it, I promise. Just go slow, whichever, look in your mirrors. You'll see them trailer tires right there. They start veering off, turn your steering wheel just a little bit. Don't overcompensate. If it's going the wrong way, turn it the other way. It'll straighten right out. You're going to have some ramps that are at a bigger incline than others. Not a big deal. Once you get down over that, if you just go slow and you're going straight when you back over it, your truck's going to follow it right on down. You'll see it. Look over your shoulder. You're still straight. You just keep going. The more you practice, the better you'll get at it. And I promise you, you're going to learn how to do it. It'll give you more quality time with your significant other. You'll be confident before you even know it. And that there's your B&M tip of the month.